Hey guys, it's Ash. Um, a quick message from me. Um, I am going to be having a baby in a few weeks, about three weeks from now actually. My wife and I are going to be having our second child. Um, because of that, my wife's out of work. She's not going to be working um, and I will be the sole provider for our family. So to raise some scratch uh, and help pay the bills over the next couple coming months, I'm going to be selling off one of my 40k armies. Um, now this 40k army is an all Forge World Red Scorpion army that I built when the Anfelion project book came out. Um, I built it for a Games Day display in 2008. Um, and it's about, oh geez, I don't know how many points it is. It's probably close to four and a half or 5,000 points. Um, it's an entire battle company, Red Scorpions. Um, so six, actually seven tactical squads. There's a bonus tactical squad in there. Um, two Devastator squads, two assault squads, um, some transports for all the above, command squads, bunch of selection of captains, librarian, um, and then an element of the first company. So 25 Terminators, five assault Terminators, 20 regular Terminators, variety of heavy weapons, um, 10 Stern Guard, five Vanguard vets, and this special character, Caleb Cohn. Um, on top of that, there is two Fortress Dreadnoughts, a Mark IV Dreadnought with a Last Cannon, and a Breaching Drill slash Heavy Flamer, um, and a, um, what is it? Venerable Forge Rolled Red Scorpion Dreadnought. So I'm gonna walk you through the models right now. You can check them out, check out the conversions. Um, and I will be selling this through my Facebook page. Just a quick private sale. Um, I'd like to see $2,000 US for the army. Um, that's about cost when you factor in painting and stuff like that. Um, or best offer. And by best offer, um, you can send me an offer more than that. I will go with whoever sends me the best offer um, come the 31st of January, so the end of next week. Um, so you can send that to me at your best offer through my Facebook page or at my email, ash at um, My Facebook page is facebook.com slash out of the basement into the streets. Uh, so let's take a look at the army right now. Check it out. I hope you like it. Um, and thanks everybody uh, who decides they want to help out and buy my Red Scorpion army uh, to help out me and my family while we're having the new baby. Hey guys, here's the army along with the two carrying cases it will come packed in. Um, there will be no refunds, returns, or exchanges. Obviously, this is a final sale, um, as it's my army, and I won't have time to add anything new to it, so please no requests for that kind of stuff. First coming element we have, Calm, with his Relic Blade slash Terminator Armor, a uh, unit of Thunder Armor and Storm Shield Terminators, a uh, unit of five Terminators with a heavy, sorry, with an Assault Cannon, ten Terminators with two Assault Cannons and a Sergeant, five Terminators with an Assault, sorry, a Heavy Flamer, yeah, a Heavy Flamer, and Chain Fists. There's a variety of Chain Fists in all these squads. Um, on top of that, from the first company element, we have a full unit of uh, Red Scorpion veterans. So these are the um, Stern Guard veterans. There's some cool conversions in there because these guys are supposed to be Tyranid fighters. I used the old uh, Tyrannic War Vets miniatures and converted them to be cool Stern Guard. Um, so there's some Stern Guard, some Kyogre puts in there, and of course Stern Guard Sergeant. Uh, we've got a unit of Vanguard vets, five um, big Relic Blade, Chain Swords, Plasma Pistols, Power Swords, stuff like that. Um, and then on to the company itself. So here's my three captains. We've got a Lightning Claw Power Fist uh, captain. We have my converted, um, what's his name, Pedro Cantor, because I would use him as actually Pedro Cantor and use his rule sometimes. My Thunderhammer captain's a limited edition games day miniature, the Thunderhammer, um, and you could have him have a Storm Shield and stuff too. Got a Labarian with a Four Sword, and then we've got a five man command squad, uh, Apothecary, uh, Melt a Gun, Power Fist, Company Champion, and of course the standard. They're riding around into this Forge World um, Red Scorpion uh, La Twin Link Laz Cannon Razorback. So they usually pick up one of these characters and then drive around in it. Um, as far as the heavy support teams, we've got the Fire Suppression Squad with four heavy bolters, all in Mark IV Forge World Power Armor. Uh, we've got the Marks, all Mark VI, um, not Forge World, just Mark VI. I collect enough bits to make all these guys in different Marks of Power Armor. It actually helps tell the squads apart. These guys are all Mark VI, um, and they've got four Laz Cannons, a Tank Hunter Squad. Fast Tacks, we've got um, Mark IV um, Assault Squad, Power Fist, three Plasma Pistols. We've got the Mark Seven Power Fist, three Plasma Pistols, uh, Assault Squad. And we've got Mark IV Tactical Squad number, is that one? That's two. And the Rhino with the extra armor plates, all Forge World. Um, they've got a Power Fist Plasma Gun, Last Cannon. Power Fist Plasma Gun, Last Cannon, that's Squad one right there. Uh, and their Rhino, again with the Forge World extra armor and stuff. We've got another Mark IV Tactical Squad, um, Laz Cannon and Plasma Gun. And then we've got Drop Pod Squad 1 with a Plasma, sorry, a, um, plasma Gun, Multi Melta, and Power Fist. Um, same thing over here. This is the Mark VIII Squad. I actually collected enough bits of the High Gorget, these guys are pretty cool, that they've all got Mark VIII Power Armor, which I was pretty proud of actually at the time. Can we focus on him? There we go, there he is. And his Mark VIII Power Armor. Um, and then Mark VI. 
Tactical Squad. Over here on the other drop pod, this is a Forge World old drop pod. Um, done up in red scorpion colors, and they've got the uh, all Mark VI. Again, not Forge World, this is just a Mark VI with all the Forge Worldy bits to make them red scorpions. And they've got a plasma gun and a multi multi as well. We got two Forge World Dreadnoughts, Mark IV, Twin League Laz Cannon. Just counts the Power Fist usually, but it's also a Breaching Drill slash Heavy Flamer. And then the venerable um, Forge World Dreadnought. So there it is, man. Got a whole battle company, plus a big, large contingent of first company guys, um, plus some vehicles and support and stuff like that and characters. Um, so like I said, if you're interested in it, please send me a message, either ash at uh, Starting opening bid would be 2000 bucks US. Um, I can take PayPal. Uh, and of course, we would ship it out in these two large cases that have already been custom designed uh, to hold these models. So shipped, tracked, all that stuff, two grand um, USD. If not, then your best offer over that would be great. And I will take whoever the best offer is. And that's it on my Facebook page. So that's facebook.com slash out of the basement into the streets. I hope to hear from some people soon. Let me know. And thanks again for taking